Scaloni has signed a contract extension, keeping him as the Argentina boss through 2026. Gam, I'm really shocked. Are you? Yeah, I would have thought that winning yeah. the World Cup. Get rid and, of him. And doing it on like, uh, by the way, Scaloni, I think among the big nations anyway, one of the lowest paid uh, national team coaches yeah, at the yeah. World Cup. Um, I'm glad he got his reward. Uh, you know, yeah. he, I, I think in some ways, I think his impact on this World Cup from a man management perspective mm. was, I, I think it's been kind of underplayed. You know, he's not a tactical genius, but he found a way to make it work with yep. a guy, albeit the GOAT of all time or close to it, who walks around the pitch all the time. Yeah, yeah. And yet you can still play modern football. You find the right pieces about it. He, he, he did trial and error. He wasn't afraid to change things. Yeah. He's done very well. Everybody seems to like it. They all talk about what a great environment the, 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 the national team is. Um, that's down to him. That's what you want. You want players who want to play for your national team. And as we know, true. living in England, for example, not many years ago, you know, it was pretty obvious that there were people who were like, oh, this is an yeah, yeah, ordeal, yeah, right. right? Not you're the right. case with Argentina. Com completely. Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.